still on the ground. <laughs> Hi! I'm back at Lala's house. It's almost exactly two weeks from the last vlog that I filmed here. And it looks so different. It's so green. The trees it's are so like green. insane. It's so green. It was so bare up there. You can barely see the sunset back there now. Oh yeah, the trees cover it. it. Cover it. It's almost 4 p.m. but Lala made me a latte. So <laughs> <laughs> I normally I make a coffee around 7 7 p.m. Really? Mm -hmm. My last coffee on a day. <laughs> it really depends on the day if, if it would keep me up or not. Like if I had woken up super early and had a busy day, I feel like I could drink coffee at yeah. night and be fine. Yeah. But some days, it's just yeah too much. We're gonna go thrifting at Plato's Closet, which is like, a, it's a thrift store for sure, but it's very like particular. So they'll have more current brands. So like more fancy trips. Yeah, like definitely. Okay. That's actually, this is where I bought these shoes. But it's very cheap. Like five years ago. Yeah, like I got these shoes for under 20 bucks for sure. They'll have like champion stuff. They'll yeah. have Fabletics. Even like stores like um, Forever 21, Shein, stuff like that. They'll have those like more cheaper they options. Have, like, Second hands. Fashion Nova, I think. Yeah, Fashion Nova. Like I saw that. them post that. Um, yep. PacSun, Brandy Melville. So it's like, a trendy thrift store? Yeah. I yeah, guess. Yeah. It's a very big store. And their Instagram is really nice too because they like put outfits together and yep. make displays and stuff. I go there all stuff. the time and I was like, I need to take Sasha there. But mm -hmm. she already has been there. But before. I haven't been in like five years. <laughs> so I'm glad you mentioned it, honestly. Because yeah. I've been following them because we go to the Play Doh Closet Warwick is the one in Rhode Island. And I've been following them on Instagram forever, but they don't pop up on my feed anymore for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> there yeah. she is. We're here. Have any locals ever been here? Let us know. Target and Walmart. I want to grab some film if Walmart has it. over here because I have like boxes of merch. But the cats are just hanging out in the sun. Hello, I'm in the rainbows right now. I have these little sun catchers on my windows that when direct sunlight shines through them, they cast lovely rainbows across the house. But it is the next day, clearly. I ended up hanging out with Lala for a little bit longer at her house. And by the time I got home, it was dark. So I figured I would do the try on portion today. And it is like 80 degrees out again and I'm so happy. I have a bunch of windows open. But I'm wearing uh, new pants. I got these from Plato's Closet, which we love Plato's Closet. I hadn't been in so, so long. And I'm so happy that we ended up going yesterday because I, I think I spent like $58 it was. And I got a bunch of stuff. I'm so, so happy. But these pants were $10. The brand, the tag says um, So, like S-O, and I swear that's a Kohl's brand. I think it's a Kohl's brand, but I really like these. I feel like they could definitely pass as pajamas, but I don't know. I still think they're cute, and especially if I wear them with like a little tank top or even just like this kind of cropped tee. Um, I mean, this isn't really cropped. It's just... It, it ends like right at my waistline. Uh, waistline. I think it looks great with this, and I feel like I could wear it with yellow, I could wear it with orange, I could wear it with blue, and then pink, of course. 
and I'm just really happy about it and then oh uh, they just fit so so well but I'm gonna have to figure out where I want to film this try on haul and film it let me show you my pile Here's my pile of things that we got yesterday. But I love these pants so much. They're just like the perfect high waist, like right above the belly button. And they have like a stretchy back. And then this shirt I got like a month ago from Target, but I think they still have this style. I don't know if they have this exact pink color, but maybe I'll try on all of the tops. I feel like all of the tops that I have pretty much match with these pants which is kind of cool oh and then i got a really cute little necklace from target too it's like this pretty little gold thing and has a little b on it hold on i need a but it's so cute i love this i feel like this is a cute little summer staple necklace to wear all right this is the same shirt but a size bigger and a different color of course i don't i can't decide it might be a little too big I feel like this is just like, it's not sitting well on me. So maybe we return this one? I don't know. It's not awful. $10. <laughs> All right, this is one of the shirts from Plato's Closet. This was also $10. And it's obviously just a pale yellow, a um, little bit more of a cropped t-shirt. And the brand said TNA. I have no idea what that is, but I think it looks cute with these pants. And I think it'll look cute with other just like summery pants that I have very cute i feel like i just wanted a bunch of summer t-shirts i feel like because i have so many just like tight cropped tank tops and i'm just like not as into that right now i kind of like the more flowy i guess oversized not that this is oversized i feel like this fits me really well and it does have like a slight cropping to it but it's just not like skin tight you know all right here's another plato's closet find this was seven dollars and the tag says we the free but this is a very very oversized like mildly cropped shirt but i like the way this one fits i feel like this could be just like a relaxed summer outfit or could just be like a nice little pajama shirt and i'm happy with both of those options and i like the color a lot the gold yellow you know i love my yellow i'm just gonna take my pants off right here oh <laughs> these are eight dollar shorts oh they fit so nice oh i like them I got a small. I probably could have gone with an extra small, but I don't know. Oh my god, this color. I feel like I'm about to go like to gym class or to like run track and field or something. <laughs> oh, this is fun. I like this shirt. I'm glad I got it. This one was $12. You can see it's got like a, a stitching where the three colors kind of match or line up or whatever. Very cute. Oh, this is a colorful <laughs> look right now oh i never even noticed this detail but the stitching along the shoulder is like a hot pink color it's really cute all right another loose but slightly cropped shirt this is like a very very pale mauve almost like it's pink but it's almost got a bit of a lavender tone to it and this was another one of the ten dollar t-shirts and i think this would match the the pants pretty well as well just simple basics so the skirt i feel like i mainly got this for like some cute pictures only five dollars and it's i think it's the wild fable brand it's got like a nice little slit in the leg i'll definitely bring this to our fairy house airbnb next week i don't think i own many if any skirts to be honest i have any i should let me go look at myself in the mirror okay it's really cute i haven't even looked at it in the mirror but i like it a lot these shorts fit me like perfectly they have like weird pockets <laughs> that are just like straight down and they're a little bit small but i'm honestly grateful for pockets at all and they have fat pockets anyways but these were seven dollars they're from old navy i think old navy wb shorts whatever that means maybe i'll go to old navy and see if they have more shorts because these fit me so so well and of course the like golden mustardy color and they're like slightly high-waisted and right at the belly button and seven dollars this was from target and i honestly got this shirt to sleep in because i just wanted something that like you know covers my butt completely and i can just wear it to bed just nothing else just a t-shirt and i like red i feel like i was saying this on my live stream the other day i don't know if this is a thing but I feel like I look good in primary colors, like red, yellow, and blue. Whereas I feel like lavender, I don't, I don't know. I, it not, I, I feel like it doesn't look 
great on me. <laughs> Even like the color of those blue shorts, I love that color. Obviously I love the red and then like the golden yellow. My prom dress was actually like, not as goldeny, but it was a yellow color. And I was really happy with that decision. Ketchup and mustard right now though. Oh, how much were the biker shorts? Only $7. Oh my God, that's so cheap. I will be wearing these a lot in the summer. Just super basic. I, don't, I feel like the last couple years, biker shorts have gotten a lot more popular and I love just wearing these with like, not this big of an oversized t-shirt, but like a bigger t-shirt. I mean, that doesn't... Oh yeah, also the like basic cami shirt. I just wish it wasn't so long, to be honest. Maybe I'll cut it. So just, I would love if it ended like right here. I feel like it would be perfect. Like a little bit below the belly button. But I got these... Can you tell that they're flared? They almost look like acid wash denim, but it's really just like blue and white tie-dye kind of. These ones give me like a... 70s 80s kind of vibe and it looks good with like a bright colored shirt like a bold red or even like a blue i feel like it would look really good with these but the pants were both 8.98 each and the tank top i think was three dollars i don't think it has a tag on it i think it had a sticker that i already pulled off but they were like 2.98 or something all right last but not least this little green you know what i take back the primary color thing i guess because i do like green Especially like, no, I guess both light and dark. This is kind of like a sage green, but like with the white kind of mixed in, it looks very light. But uh, this was a Lulu's dress from Plato's Closet. It was $18 and it's very good quality. It's like double lined, which is very nice. And then you can tie this. So like I was able to tighten it a little bit more for me because I feel like I have a, like, like this part of my chest is like shorter than some people. So I feel like I really needed to, tied in a little bit because the, the V was going a little bit wide for me. All right, that's it for the clothing haul. I think I'm actually going to not end off this little vlog video because tomorrow we're going to put up a little bit of fencing around our garden area at Brendan's parents' house. So I'll get a couple clips of that and I don't think I'm doing anything exciting for the rest of the day. I'm just going to be streaming at some point. So I'm not sure if I'll pick up the camera again today, but I will see you tomorrow. Oh, I'm so excited that I'm gonna have an excuse to come here just about every day in the summer. It's just such a beautiful drive. Like literally just the drive here puts me in a good mood. I think I'm gonna put on my garden shoes. I don't know. We should go inside and see our niece first. Alright, we got a fence around the garden. I think it's very noisy around here between the animals and now a plane going over. But we just laid a little bit of soil just for like, you know, a little added nutrients to the ground. And then we have this path down the center which we're gonna get some flat stones. I think I should wait. 
All right, we're gonna get some flat stones to go down this path in the center because I feel like that'll be easier to just like reach everything. But everything is still like within the garden. So we'll have to like step over this to get into it, which, you know, is easy enough. And then I have those trellises. I feel like I should put them like in this corner because that gets a decent amount of sun and it should definitely be like on the edge. But we're not gonna plant anything until next week and I'll definitely do another vlog for that. But we did pretty much everything we wanted to do, plus some. We weren't expecting to do the soil today, but we ended up doing it. There she is. I'll show you her from a couple different angles. Here's the angle with the woods behind. You can see the pool over here. So excited. All right, one week from now, there will be veggies in the ground. It was always on fire, our house, our we were dancing on a wire, reckless, it seemed. We found holes in these walls, we like what we saw. Seems so strong until it falls, the fire. 